What's going on guys? So I just got one of the most expensive projector I have ever owned. This is the Vava 4K Ultra Short Throw Projector. I did got a pretty good deal on it since it was on sale. I will leave a link to it in the description box down below. That way you guys can check it out. Now after you click the link, make sure when you look at the listing, you clip the coupon. That way you can get the discount to it. So let's go ahead and dive right into the video guys. So I am in my room, as you can see, light is totally off. On, so it is bright light right now and the window let me go ahead and open the window to show you it is daytime out there and check this out guys there's no doubt that this projector is amazing when it comes to display quality now one thing i was not able to tell from watching other youtuber videos is guys the actual size of this projector it's actually huge guys and i use my tape measurement right there to actually measure the dimension so it is 14 and a half inches from front to back and four and a half inches from top to bottom and 21 inches from right to left so it is pretty big and it weighs about 15 pounds or so pretty pretty heavy as well so right now as you can see the screen you're looking at right now is about 134 inches screen from diagonally like that and yes i measure it so currently the projector is about from the wall to the front side, it is exactly one foot away, and from the wall all the way to where the projection occur is exactly two foot away from the wall. So, from two foot away from the wall, this is what you are going to get, about 134 inches on the wall. And I'm using my white wall as a projection, um, you know, wall screen. And it looks pretty nice. And again, guys, total daytime, and light is also on in the room so it is pretty pretty clear let me go ahead and play a quick video for you guys i actually have it playing right there so let's go ahead and turn on the big screen here two chains by sticking that little piece back in there so and on the ends here as you can see it comes with all everything you need already all this comes with it so you this is one of my older videos just like this on one end of the gate and the other end is so again this is a 4k projector so it is very very clear even during the day like right now so you can even use this as a regular tv if you want the speaker that is built in there is actually Harman Kardon speaker which is very very good if you have a small room if you want something like you know a real home theater speaker then i would suggest you to actually attach bigger home theater speakers on it now this would do on the go if you don't want you know anything too massive but you know again if you want something much much better like a real theater then you will need to attach your own speaker on it so let me go ahead and uh, shut the window and then i'm gonna shut off the light now to show you a better look at the projector screen guys check this out very very clear so let me extend the video oh that cover is a change it's not that important but you know you would want to have this rail on there so once i noticed that this was happening i put the rail on there and it no longer you know further damage it or anything and now it works perfectly fine and now let me go ahead and demonstrate it and close it uh one more time where the remote control over here is okay so to close it you hit the same button one more time and it will close and look how uh, it automatically closed once this little magnet piece right here matches the magnet so once again guys picture quality is amazing and it has android 7.1 so pretty old firmware good thing is you can actually upgrade it when they come out with a new firmware and it's very plain and simple as you can see right there so the first block you have hdmi 1 hdmi 2 and 3 and then you have your app store with the file manager multi-screen and then i downloaded the youtube app down here as you can see it and on top all the way up you can connect to your wi-fi bluetooth and then your settings inside a setting you can connect it to uh wi-fi and then all your sources you can control the display here's a quick look at it 
pretty basic stuff in here guys and audio quality again pretty basic all the general and Bluetooth so again guys all the settings are very very basic let me show you how the uh, YouTube app actually look okay so this is what YouTube looked like if you were to download the actual YouTube app on the projector itself um, it's nice to have this feature but what I don't like is you have to control everything with the remote control that comes with it and it is pretty you know time consuming at times clicking every individual letters like that you can download the Vava app on your phone iPhone and iOS and then use your phone as a remote control but even with that being so it's not most you know it's not so user friendly and it's not as accurate and it's not as fast so um that's one thing i do not like about it and for such an expensive projector i believe it should have a uh, more friendly uh, and easier user interface when it comes to application and another thing that uh, was kind of disappointing to me is this projector does not have you know built in um like something like a chromecast stick so you can't just simply show like youtube videos on your phone and mirror it directly onto the projector itself you can however after you download the projector app you can mirror your pictures and your videos that is already in your phone onto the projector but you cannot mirror youtube videos onto the projector itself so what i did i pretty much just bought me a um you know chromecast stick as you can see right there and then i connect it to one of the hdmi uh, uh, slot source and then just directly play all of my videos from my phone and then show it directly onto the projector itself so now let's with the light back on again now and you can still see everything very clearly which is amazing guys so now let's go ahead and show you all the little features of the projector so the projector does come with this pretty nice remote right here and the remote control is pretty basic as well on there you have the volume up and down home back setting power button and the mute button and then you have right left up down and select button pretty much it it does require two AAA battery and it comes with it inside the box as well so let's take a closer look at the actual projector itself guys here is the projector and again, one thing that nobody mentioned in any other YouTube videos that I've watched is the actual size of it. It is pretty big comparing to any other projector. That's one of my other portable projector right there. And that one is like all in one built in with battery and everything. That's the Nebula Moors, which is amazing as well for its price tag. But this thing again, guys, dimension wise, 21 inches from right to left, 14 and a half from front to back and then about four and a half inches from top to bottom pretty big and over here you have the surrounding body is made out of uh, silver or gray fabric feels very nice you have the speaker and fan over here actually the fan the speaker runs throughout the side and back right here all right when it comes to the front of the projector you have the power source right there and you have an ethernet input a PDIF input, a AV input, as well as a audio output. That way you can connect, you know, bigger uh, theater speaker on there. One USB input for you to charge your HDMI devices, such as this Chromecast right here. And you have three HDMI input, and that is pretty much it, guys. On the top, you have the uh, Vava logo right there. And this is where the projection happens right here, this line right here, guys. It does come with a motion sensor feature. So with the motion sensor feature on, let's say if somebody happened to go in front of the projector eyes right here, the projection will automatically turn off. That way, if you have kids like myself, when my son uh, walk in front of the projector and try to look in here, the light bulb will automatically turn off. That way it will not shine into their eyes and it will not blind their eyes. And this is where your power button is located. After you plug in the power source, all you have to do is press this button once and then it will power on after a few seconds. And after that, for the first time when you power the projection on, then you actually connect the remote control to your projector by pressing the two button on the remote control. And it will show you exactly how to do that on your first time when you boot up the projector. All right, so here we are at night. Let me show you another video to show you how good the quality actually is.
What's going on guys? So in front of me I have the latest model of the Intex Excursion 5 inflatable and portable boats. And I'm super excited to actually test it out. I've seen many other YouTube reviews, videos. That's why it's read a lot of I weigh about 160 pounds. My wife about 110. He's about 30. That guy's about 30 pounds. So we are definitely under the weight limit. This thing's supposed to hold over a thousand three hundred pounds. Man, we are just floating in the backyard of our lake right here. Okay, you might want to stay, sit down, buddy. So he's able to jump up and down here. But the water in our lake is super calm and it's a pretty small lake. That is now, as for the audio quality of the Harman Kardon built-in speaker, let me go ahead and show you a quick audio clip. That way you can tell how good the audio quality is. Here goes. There he goes guys now again no doubt the picture quality is amazing with this projector audio quality is also very very good considering if you're in a small room everything about it i love minus all the cons i mentioned before now again i will leave a link to it in the description box down below that way you can get the discount just make sure after you click on the link you click the little clip coupon box that way you will get the discount as well with all that being said guys thanks everybody for watching and i will see you all in the next video